fractions in lowest term. At the end of this lesson, the students should be able to change fractions into their lowest terms. To reduce a fraction to its lowest terms, divide both the numerator and the denominator by its greatest common factor or GCF. The result is a fraction in its lowest term. The common factors of two or more numbers are the factors that are the same for each number. What is GCF? The greatest common factor, GCF, is the largest factor that is common to the numbers. Simplify 4 eighths to its lowest terms. Let's get the lowest term of 4 eighths. Step 1. Find the GCF of 4 and 8. List the factors of both number. Let us begin with number 4. The factors of 4 are the following. 1 times 4 is equal to 4, and 2 times 2 is also equal to 4. Next, let's get the factors of 8. 1 times 8 is 8, and 2 times 4 is also equal to 8. Now, let us list the factors of 4 and 8. We can now look for the greatest common factor. The GCF of 4 and 8 is 4. The next step is to divide both the numerator and denominator by 4. 4 divided by 4 is 1, and 8 divided by 4 is 2. Therefore, the simplest form of 4 eighths is 1 half. What is the simplest form of 10 fifteenths? Let us find the GCF of 10 and 15. Help me to get the factors of 10. Think of factors that the product is 10. Yes, 1 times 10 is 10. And 2 times 5 is 10. Next, let's find the factors of 15. 1 times 15 is 15, and 3 times 5 is also equal to 15. Listing all the factors of 10 and 15. We can now look for the greatest common factor of 10 and 15. The GCF of 10 and 15 is 5. Now, divide both the numerator and denominator by 5. 10 divided by 5 is 2, and 15 divided by 5 is 3. 2 thirds is the lowest term of 10 fifteenths. Simplify 3 ninths or 3 over 9 to its lowest term. When we list the factors of 3 and 9, we will see the common factors. The greatest common factors of 3 and 9 is 3. Again, when you get the GCF of both numbers, divide the numerator and denominator to it. Let us now divide numerator and denominator by 3. So, the lowest term of 3 ninths is 1 third. With the understanding of the concept of greatest common factor, GCF, of a pair of numbers, Kevin and his classmates now find it easy to convert fractions to lowest terms. Can I simplify two-thirds further? We cannot divide the numerator and the denominator of two-thirds by the same number except by one. Two-thirds is the simplest equivalent fraction of eight-twelfths. Here are some examples of fractions in their lowest terms. 9 twelfths or 9 over 12. The GCF of 9 and 12 is 3. Divide 9 and 12 by 3. The answer is 3 fourths. Next is 20 over 25. The greatest common factors of 20 and 25 is 5. Divide the numerator and denominator by 5. The lowest term of 20 over 25 is 4 fifths. 2 sixths or 2 over 6. The GCF of 2 and 6 is 2. Divide the numerator and denominator by 2. 1 third is the lowest term of 2 sixths. Remember, when the GCF of the numerator and denominator is not 1, the fraction is not in its lowest term. When GCF of the numerator and the denominator is 1, the fraction is in its lowest term. Let us practice. Simplify the following fractions. 